Okay, hello everyone. So, in this video, I will give a review about my new Gundam, which is the Gundam DN from the Anima Gundam Build Fighter Tri Series. Yay! Actually, the reason why I buy this Gundam is uh, because it looks so badass. <laughs> As you can see here, it also have the big hand with the big mouth. So actually, this Gundam have a three face. One, two, and three. And actually, uh, the other reason is so that my friends, Gayan, <laughs> have the friend with the same big hand, and they can greet each other with their big hand. <laughs> okay, just kidding. And actually, this Gundam is from the. If you see the animal, this is. From uh, this kind of is from the Team Celestial Spear, as you can see here, and the pilot is Nogado. But unfortunately, if you see in the box, you cannot find Sagado. Okay, and beside this Gundam in this Celestial Spear uh, team, it's also have the Transient Gundam and the Important Gundam. And I think from those three. Uh, Gundam, the most badass Gundam is the TN Gundam itself. And as you see, can you see here? Uh, yeah, the first, the first uh, feature of this Gundam is that, yeah, is that that uh, this Gundam has the two big hands, additional hand, and as you can see here also, it has. Uh, I don't know how I can see this. Uh, how can I say about this one? But maybe let's see. Uh, let's say about. This creature as a minion, <laughs> and this minion is come from uh, this Gundam the end mod. Uh, no, no stomach. I think I mean, and the other thing is uh, this Gundam is actually looks like uh, if you s if you know the Gundam Wing series, this Gundam is looks like a Gundam Dead Side Hell here. So because this ha uh, this kind of have the some kind of shield uh, in the in front of and actually it can be used also from uh, for some kind of wing and actually this Gundam is uh, base is from the Dead Side Gundam and from the Devil Gundam from the G Gundam series if you know the series so okay this is the box and it's actually lit looks very awesome I think the color is very good compare uh, good uh, proportion uh, with the purple color and I think it's very awesome and let's try to open the box and this is the instruction and you can see here this is the Saga Ado okay I will not give on any detail about uh, who is the Saga Ado and because that is not important. And okay, as you can see here, sorry, this is the base of the Gundam. The first is the Dead Side Gundam, and the second is the Devil Gundam. And okay, this is the feature of this Gundam. It has the big hand, the stomach that can. Uh, it says can be open like a ma uh, mouth and it's also have some kind of big eyes here <laughs> and the armaments of this kind of actually uh, it use uh, some kind of pistol to fall for here and in the series actually these two uh, hands can uh, bite another Gundam and it also can produce any kind of beam laser or something and yeah this is the the, the instruction actually it's not really important okay so that's all and actually for totally it has uh, one two three four five oops five seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and two elf runner 
total 12 runner and I think it's a big number for a fandom and as you can see here there is a sticker and yeah it's a lot of sticker I, I also think that uh, because I think that uh, the more sticker you have is it doesn't look good actually <laughs> but yeah I'm not sure and yeah that's all I think and the color itself is mostly black and this color is purple for the chest side and then this is for the hand side it's usually uh, uh, it is it will be uh, gray and the hand itself the clouds will be yellow and then this part is for the minion I think it looks like a unicorn condom but uh, it looks nasty I think and this part I'm not sure what is this okay so this is another hand so actually yeah I think that is the the inside of the this kind of the end box so let's try to assemble it and I will do it as soon as possible Okay, so hello everyone. Uh, finally, I'm finished to build this uh, Gundam DN model, and actually, I'm finished. Uh, I'm set very satisfied with this with the result. Actually, uh, there are so much. Uh, no, no, not so much, but just a little uh, weakness in this model. The first one is about the sticker. There is a lot of sticker, and I think that this is very annoying for me because as you know here for example the the head part is a little bit rounded right but for the uh, sticker itself is flat so somehow the sticker cannot attach properly and some part uh, like here for the example for the right leg part maybe okay so now it's a little okay oh sorry <laughs> okay now still focus right uh, the problem is it cannot attach within the this part and the left part so there is a little gap here this is because of uh, the you know the soft part of the Gundam this one the size of this part is doesn't match doesn't match with the uh, the hard part so it's a little bit uh, make it's very hard to attach uh, these two part to two parts together actually I'm also a little bit lazy because actually you can modify it by somehow cut the soft part so that uh, it can attach properly in the hard part but 
um, I'm a little bit lazy so I don't do much about that and for the join itself uh, actually I think that let's say for the, the big hand parts I think that at, at first time I think that the hand the finger thing uh, what I mean can move separately but, but as you can see here it's uh, it's stuck together it's stuck together so you cannot do much more to the hand part unless you just can do like this like this and for the uh, this finger uh, somehow it can move more better than this one but uh, okay you cannot do anything else unless like this and you cannot do anything else and then for the wing part it somehow as you can see here it can be like this and it can move like this and you can attach it together so maybe I will give you the example like this or A okay A and you can join it together as you can see here there is some part like this and you just join it like this Okay, so now it's done, right? And you can change the position. Okay, so something like this. Okay, and this is the backpack, and this is how uh, it attached together. So this uh wing part is for for the hand the big hand part and the upper part is for the uh silk part i said that this is the silk part and actually there's a lot of gimmick for this gundam uh, as you can see in the series there is a tool the forward part here and you can put it this kind of hand like this and you can change the uh, basic hand oops okay like this okay as you can see here right and the other thing is uh, okay let's see what we can do with the big hand parts so basically this is the big hand part right and what you can do with this part is first you can remove the big hand part and then you can add this kind of join like this and like this okay so the, the big hand can move more technically uh, something like this okay it's the same with this uh, in the series part and the other thing that you can do with the uh, big hand part is there is additional uh, mouth no no not mouth so the face of the TN Gundam which actually is very hard to uh, remove <laughs> oops okay so you can remove that right and you can put here and this part is 
here. So it looks like uh, the face have uh, some kind of tooth that can bite like this. Okay, and actually it cannot move. It cannot move just like this. Just stay like this. Uh, another thing is uh, what you can do is you can uh, you can block this part actually. It's very hard. <laughs> okay, let's. I I will remove the heads it's because it's very annoying to uh, pull all the things and. very hard. I must use this knife. Oops. <laughs> Somehow I'm afraid that I will make this part is broken. Okay, so it's now. Now it's. Uh, I will. Uh, I already uh, unattached this part, right? And as you can see here, there is two hole here. And it so uh, will make the shoulder part this different. If you put the hole, the upper hole, to this part, it will make something like this, the normal one. But if you put the lower hole, this part it will make something like this. So you can somehow you can see uh, big eyes in the shoulder part. And again, you can attach here. Okay, and the other thing is you can remove the chest part like this, and it's the same. It has a two holes, and if you put the lower hole into the chest part, somehow it looks like this, and also the bottom one. It also have the have two holes you can put here so there will be some kind of uh, hole hole in this part and you can put this minion here okay so it looks like this one oops oh so it looks like this one and <laughs> Actually, there is uh, an additional hand, and there is no hole in this part, so you can uh, you cannot put the revolve part here, and you just can change it like this. Okay, like this. Mm. Sorry. Maybe uh, annoying you like this. Okay. <laughs> okay. So that's all my review about the Gundam DM, the AC one over one hundred forty four, the fighter uh, series. And actually, in my opinion, this is very uh, good model and. Uh, it has many gimmicks and actually the, the weakness on for this Gundam actually it just only have so many sticker and then in some part it doesn't match each other so there is uh, there will be some gap in some part and actually it's not only the leg only but in some part there is, uh, it's very hard to attach the uh, the part together and well actually yeah that's all my comment for this Gundam uh, actually, I, I believe that this is worth 
Spotify if you like the Gundam uh, Fighter Tri series. And okay, that's all my uh, review for this Gundam. If you have any comment on, or maybe if you have any suggestion. Um, what should I review in the next video you can comment and maybe if you like my video you can sus uh, subscribe my channel so that's all uh, my review so thank you all for the watching and see you see you Bye.